Anti-slip workbench protection dogs. What are these things? I'm Ron Polk and this is the Smart Wood Shop. If you want to get a detailed set of plants to build a smart wood shop for yourself, one of the three Polk smart benches or any of the accessories that work with all three of the benches, click on the link in the description of this video down below where you can purchase plans and download them 24-7, 365. Recently, I ordered some tools from Axminster Tool. And when I was unpacking the box, there was this little plastic package that it was something I didn't order and it didn't have a name on it or anything. It was just in the box. So I opened it up and found these little mushrooms. The, they're like uh, kind of silicon or something, the orange part uh, embedded in some aluminum buttons. So I had to go on their website and see what they were and what they were about. And they're pretty simple. They are just simply a like a little dog. They fit in these 20 millimeter holes and they elevate the material you're cutting on your MFT table above the table slightly so that you don't cut into your bench. All of the Smart Wood Shop gang knows that I don't cut my bench tops ever, even a little bit, because I use sacrificial strips. But not everybody uses them, and this might be a good uh, option or opportunity. They didn't ask me to make this video. They're not paying me to make this video. I had them, and I just thought, well, I'll pass it along. It might be something that you're interested in. So you get a, a little package of eight, and for that eight, they're a $20. Drop them in to your bench dog holes. So you can't see this with the camera, but they are hovering above the bench surface. Uh, it looks like about five millimeters or so. So this is an 18 millimeter piece of material. And I know that the material is about five millimeters above the bench. So I'll set up my saw to cut through the 18 mil and a little bit more. So I'll set it on 20. The use of these is pretty straightforward. There's not a big learning curve in this. The only thing I'd say about them is that I would, uh, maybe if I were them, I would make them a little thicker. So these little um, silicon pieces that are on there, I, the orange pieces, you know, maybe have them more like 10 millimeters above the bench to give you just a little bit more safety so you don't, you know, accidentally uh, skin the, your, your bench top. If, uh, if this is something that'll work for you, I will go ahead and put a link in the description of the video down below so you can go check them out for yourself. I'm not involved with them. Don't make any money off of them. Uh, it's just something that, that I got and I thought I'd share them with you. Again, I use sacrificial strips, but I could see if, uh, you know, maybe have a couple of kits of these. They're really small. And if you're just doing a quick job and you just uh, are all set up, you can just drop these in and protect your bench. If you like these videos, then give me a thumbs up. That drives the YouTube algorithm up. So these videos get served up to more people, which of course helps support the channel. Thanks for dropping into the Smart Wood Shop. You stay safe and don't cut your bench top.